Because these fish, they run in in the spring, uh, March through June, July sometimes, and, uh, and they hold, hold in the river for months before spawning without eating, really. Um, their presence in the watershed just indicates how high quality the, the habitat and the water is and their, their ability to survive. At this point, I haven't seen like a lot of mortality for when we've done the surveys, but it's been noted in years past that they found you know dead adults and the, those kind of things, and that just shows that the fish are extremely stressed and the conditions are are poor for their survival. When the Mad River was listed for as temperature impaired was 2005, and there wasn't a whole lot of sampling that was happening to show like okay we know the Mad River is warm, but like how warm and how is this affecting you know aquatic populations. 